Good morning. How's everybody doing this beautiful morning? Hello, everybody. <laughs> Are y'all ready to do some painting? Hey, Lynn. Vanessa, good morning. Hey, Miss Sandra. Glenda, good morning. Texas Nana. Lisa Garcia, good morning. Miss Shannon King. All right. McMillan, good morning. Hello from Florida. Shep M, good morning. Patricia from California. Melissa. Miss Smith, good morning. How you doing? Come on in. Get you a big old glass of sweet tea. We're fit and do some painting. Jolie Hayden, good morning. Miss Monique, hello, good morning. Miss Sheila, smash that like button, that's ask, right. Ask Monique where was she at yesterday. Monique, where was you at yesterday? Gypsy Life, good morning. Betty, good morning, Wash, uh, Whit Wilmington, North Carolina. Lisa Whittington, good morning. Texas Nana, Kathy Fields, y'all come on in. Get you a big old glass of sweet tea. We're going to have fun today. Monique said she had a friend there. Mesa, good morning. Ha ha. What's going on? Gonna be doing some Gonna be doing some painting today. I got a whole bunch of whole bunch of stuff here to be painting. <coughs> Crazy K just got off a 24 hour shift. Woo! Dog gone. I know you tired. Helen Montana. How about that? Pamela? Houston, Texas, good morning. PJ Manley, good morning. Good morning. A little under the weather, but good. Well, ha ha, you gotta get better. Hey, Miss Peggy. Good morning, mystery man. <laughs> hey, good morning. Farm wife, Central Illinois. I hear there's good, good uh, hunting up there in Central Illinois. I always hear about the big old trophies up there. I ain't never been. Pam Pullen, Arkansas. Good morning. Do y'all hear the birds, y'all? Do you hear multiple birds? Hey, the birds is coming. They done found the feeders. Every time I come outside, I scare them off. But, hey, Miss Betty, 
Love hearing you talk, telling the truth about this world. Miss this man's night, Miss Baby. That's something I kind of can't help. <laughs> Miss Lisa, it's addicting. Lisa Harold, hey from Texas. Sunshine and chickens. Whitewash painting video. How about that? Yes, the birds, y'all. Hey, Grace. Yes, the birds are singing away. I'm so glad they, they're finding the seeds. I enjoy feeding them. Yeah, I had hundreds and hundreds of birds. And uh, had to regroup. But I'm going to get them back. Slowly but surely, you can count on it. I love feeding them. I love hearing them. I love to see them uh, just come light right here on the feeder, like by my head. Uh, it's just beautiful thing. Hey, Miss Peggy, red velvet cake. Woo! That's that's like Mr. Man's favorite. Except for that time he he sat down and ate a whole one. Did that that work, don't you? Didn't it? Uh, Tina Madden trying to get this headache to go away. Hey, I, I hate that. H. Beth Prince. Yeah, that Tina hat. She has a hard time with them migraines. Yeah, I hate to hear that, little lady. Dove Lynn. Hello. Hey, Crystal. Good morning. Are y'all ready to do some painting this morning? Uh, thank you, Monique. They know where the bird houses and the food is. They'll find you. Drink lots of water. <laughs> hey, Miss Karen. Good morning. Hey, Dove Lynn. She says she's been watching your videos, Hodge. Who's that? Dove Lynn. <laughs> what do you use to seal the paint on your bird houses? This right here is crystal clear enamel. It is, uh, let me look at the dry time. I hey, heard, I've heard somebody talking about them migraines before. It's pretty quick. They said like, uh, they, what they told me is like, they don't wish it would quit. They just wish it would hurt in a different spot. <laughs> Gypsy life. Yeah, that's what I use on them. It, it uh, does a good job. <coughs> got a beautiful day out here. It's a little overcast and got a little breeze, so it feels great out here. Grandma be excited. I got a little bigger brush. <laughs> Diana, good morning. Hey, Jackie. Feel your goodness soul. Hey, Jackie. Hey, Glenda. Usually don't get rid of the headache without a nap. Hey, I'm doing, I'm doing uh, fine, Monique. I, I woke up mad again. <laughs> Jamie's doing fine. Carla P. Hey, hey. Thank you for tuning in. Gonna gonna be painting some projects today. Gonna be sending out some love. Hey, Carla. Vanessa. She said, Danny, you out of the AC. Stephen hit me out here. Dove Lynn. Don't make Danny. Dooley? Don't make Danny mad. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, it ain't that mad. I just uh, thinking about stuff that don't that you can't do nothing about. 
and it's not even about me. Yeah. And I might have been a little cutting up, but but like I just can't, I just can't believe how big a fool people can be. You know, if you got everything you want, why mess it up? Lisa for freedom, Arizona. How about that right there? Y'all hear me? I mean, if you got a good thing going, why mess it up? They gonna they're praying for you, Danny. <laughs> it ain't good to be praying for me about. Don't be mad, life's too short. Ain't that right? Ain't that right? If you got everything going good, why mess it up? If you can do this, you can do a little more. Why well, mess it up, Daddy? <laughs> Good morning, Miss Grace. What's up, Gorilla Ms. Press? Ms. Yep. And that's a new name on me. That's there. right. That's right. We read it. Ready to do some craft. Nah, stuff. it ain't no big deal, money. Cause I, I mean, I'm not adding. I. I always think. I think in my sleep. <laughs> I swear I do. 109 here yesterday. Woo! Where you at, Gorilla? I seen it was hot over there. <laughs> I like that. Because people are stupid, Danny, that's why. Fiona, good morning. You know, I was thinking the same thing. Glenn I said, Danny, I need to start calling you, giving you a pep talk. <laughs> no, Driftwood. Uh, I guess uh, Gorilla lives in Driftwood. I seen this morning me and Stephen watching TV, watching Drift. the news, and it real hot over there in Arizona. Yeah. About 108. And it gets hotter than that, too. Good morning, Crystal Nettle. I don't think I'm going to live in From that. From Florida. Hey, Gorilla Press, where is Driftwood? I hadn't heard of it. I heard a lot Driftwood Lake. Crystal Ann, good morning. Good to see you. Diana. Monique, I can do a whole show on if you got everything you want, why mess it up? Janice Blake, the road home. How about that? Good to see you in there. Thank you for joining. Hey, there's Miss Diana. I like that name, Diana. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, Grandma told me before, I said, baby, she said, you don't always have to tell the truth. <laughs> um, you know, tell it like it is, is what she said. That's right. Yeah, Miss Janice. I got, I got some special, uh, I got some special project. Oh, there's a hummingbird. I got some special projects today that uh, I'm going to be sending out that the sweet people don't even know it yet. Um, I woke up this morning and kind of had it on my heart. And I, I got me a piece of paper and I wrote it all down. So be watching. There's going to be some stuff painted today and gave away. And I already have the people picked out. So... Stay tuned, and you can see who it is. Let's get the show on the road already. Hello, Miss Carville. <laughs> uh, yeah, I seen a man that on doing a Facebook video, and he was greeting the people like what you're doing right now. Somebody told him to hurry up. Their time was valuable. Yeah. Boy, he got mad. <laughs> But he was spending too long, like greeting, you know. Hey, he ain't gonna make me mad. Hey, hey, they told him hurry up. Every time was valuable. He ain't gonna make me mad. Call a Pete. Lizzie.
And I, I seen Vanessa in there. Yeah. It's about to get away from me. Stephen was talking. Good morning, Vanessa. Uh-oh, here's, here's Coco back. Dying aliens. All right. Miss June, she wants a white church burnt. So, get her white out. I need to have it where, like, my head's in it and I can see the project. It's uh, can you sit down? Yeah. I guess I could. If you, Stephen, if you go in there and get my tripod, it's got the handle on it and you can raise it up. I think it might help. PJ Man and Stephen takes a lot of pride in his work. He does. That's for sure. Diane said you finally made a life. Hey, you in for a treat, uh, Diane? Finally made a life. Sometimes I get on here and everybody tell me, oh, Lord, what's he fit to say? <laughs> hey, that's the truth. I know it's coming. What's he fit to say? Ain't like one in go have a pee break. Jay Johnson, good morning. I hadn't seen DJ in there. I went in there. We, we watched a video last night and I, I, I said, Tim said, what'd you say that for? I said, damn it. I think I ought to be throw it off of YouTube. <laughs> Good morning, Judy. Good morning, Judy. I said, yeah, I think I'll throw myself off of YouTube. Not like getting it on your arm already. I put some more stuff on Stephen's wish list. Well, this paint, uh, I didn't know it had went up. Yeah, everything's went up. Yeah. Farm wife, Kathy J, good morning from California. Good morning. I shall tell her. There's Miss Elizabeth. Good morning. Now, this ain't pointing nobody in particular, but some of y'all, I think y'all's parents should have liked to spend at least five more minutes trying to think of a name. What in the world? <laughs> I just kind of kidding about that. Dove and I. You know, Dove Lynn, I ain't sure if it was you or it was two Lynn's. It was, and one of them didn't want to be a moderator no more. It was Dove. It was Dove. But I took two off that was Lynn's. And I cut more people, just trying to thin it down where I can keep an eye on things a little better. They was, they was a bunch of people complaining, y'all. And they didn't, uh, they thought I, like, uh, I was sitting here looking at them, each one of them moderators, and and uh, I really wasn't, uh, I really wasn't, but they didn't want no blame. Uh, they didn't even want to, it didn't even look like they, they done anything. Yeah. <laughs> hey, Miss Diana. Hey, Miss Dan is wondering if I can make things like Steve. I'm the book writer, Diana.
Apex. I wasn't supposed to be in there. Okay. No sound, Stephen. Take a look at it. Can you hear it now? No sound. No sound. Okay, I think it's back, Steve. It's back. Got the sound back. I was about to unplug it. All right, sound is back. Steve, uh, tell me what you told me about Miss Gladys this morning, which I don't, I don't, I ain't seen her on here yet. Miss Gladys, uh, CDJJ send a donation so Miss Gladys could get her a birdhouse. She's bedridden and I'm going to be doing her birdhouse this morning, but I don't have her address. So she, she sent her address, but he didn't get it. Hey, Michelle. Good morning, Michelle. I tried to get Grandma to come up here. I said, come up here, Grandma, and show me how to paint. I said, you can pick on the size of my brush. She laughed. Julie says she's going to order a birdhouse in a couple of weeks. That sounds good to me. There's CDJJ. Good morning there, CDJJ. CDJJ. Hey, if you can get Miss Gladys's address and send it to me, because I, I have her birdhouse here to paint, but I don't have her address to send it to. Okay, hey, hey, good morning, Linda. Linda said she just wanted to jump in here. She don't know how long she's going to be here to stay. Well, good morning, Linda. CDJJ, and I mean, that's, that's quite a few, but CDJJ was one of the ones that got help get this channel going. That's right. And money. I was in there watching, and uh, I, me and Steven was up there at Lake Fish. I, man, I think made like a four-hour video or something. Yeah. And I seen Monique said, I'm going to hang around in here until this video is over. And, uh, I was kind of watching, and she did. She hung around there. She sure did. Don Hope, I'm doing pretty good. Stephen, how you doing this morning? Hey, I'm doing good. Got a beautiful day, surrounded by beautiful people, doing project from the heart. Hey, I don't know how it can get any better. Charlotte. Good morning. Annette, hello everyone. Hello, Annette. Hey, y'all like, wanna know what I'm a fool for? I'm a fool for nice people. <laughs> I thought she was gonna say a patty melt. <laughs> <laughs> I like really am a fool for nice people. Hey, you like them too, don't you? Stephen, I ain't never bought one. Grandma, 
Grandma made me eat light bread on my hamburger for so many years. Uh, like, I go out of my way to eat a hamburger bun. Yeah, do you? That's funny. Sandra Presnall, how you doing? Miss Sandra, good morning. Okay, Tina's asking for prayers, y'all. Some of y'all prayer warriors. Yeah, y'all hit the like button. I'm telling you, I'm gonna have to send y'all a notification. I'm gonna have to send each one of y'all a no notification until you remember to hit the like button. <laughs> yeah. That's the only way to eat a good hamburger. I said, I said, Mama, that don't look like no McDonald's hamburger. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, if you over 50 years old, you didn't eat, you might eat a hamburger bun when you uh, was out in the public and your mom and daddy wanted to show off and and act like they had hamburger buns. But uh, when you was at home, you was going to eat a hamburger with light bread. That's funny. I see what it was is I wanted to go to McDonald's, see? Yeah. Somebody's asked me on him. She said, I fix your hamburger better than a McDonald's hamburger. Hey, y'all. You know how I'm always telling some stuff. Steven gained some subscribers yesterday, you know, uh, on that video with me. I tell you something. Please. I have seen it when we lost some subscribers. <laughs> i tell you something funny. Daddy went to the drive-thru at Burger King. Hey, I was on the phone with him, and I heard him order. He said, let me get uh, four. He was at Burger King now. He said, let me get four quarter-pounders with cheese. And uh, they tried to get him the meal. He said, I don't want no meal. I, I don't want no drink. I just want hamburger." She said, sir, this is Burger King. He said, yeah, I know where I'm at. How much is it? She said, we don't have, uh, we don't have quarter pounders. He said, yeah, you do. I get them all the time. <laughs> she told him to pull forward. He drove up there forward. That woman, I heard him. She said, sir, this is Burger King. That McDonald's sells quarter pounders. Daddy said, why didn't you say that to start with? And drove <laughs> off. He didn't even, I mean, he didn't want a Big Mac, I don't reckon. But I mean, that, that's a true story because I heard it happen. True story. Sharon King. Uh, y'all, I tell you, I hate the craziest you ever seen. I kind of get hung on one thing. And lately, uh, we've been eating hamburgers and french fries, you know, home at home with light bread, you know. We had a hamburger bun last night. Hey, hey, uh, Linda. I don't like all that stuff with onions and green peppers, and, but you, I, I think you're talking about Stephen. Yeah, I eat it all. Well, let me correct. I don't eat jalapenos. I can't handle that tore up from the floor up. Hey, y'all, Stephen. 
was on an undefeated football team. He was the quarterback. And, uh, you know, them, it's recreation. And, like, them people get mad now. I don't know if y'all ever been to a Little League game. They get mad. And Stephen was on a undefeated team. And Stephen got thrown out of the game. And, uh, boy, I mean, Tammy, told, Tammy let him hold it now. Sometimes I have to like trying to hold Tammy back a little bit. <clears throat> but we left. We left the game, and then they lost real bad. Our team lost real bad without Stephen. Man, I could remember I could throw that football about the length of the field. Yeah. Some people can throw a football, and some people can't. And I, I never could throw one. I was a good football player, but I wasn't no quarterback. Remember the All-Star game? I was a quarterback, and it was, they took the best. They took the ten teams on the East and, and made one team out of ten teams, and then the West done the same thing, and we had an All-Star game. I was a quarterback. We won 86 to nothing. In the All Star game, uh, uh, Miss Prince, uh, that I wish Stephen would break that air fryer out and that, like, I can't hardly do nothing with him, y'all. I mean, I'm dealing with Grandma and Tammy and all that, you know. I can't hardly do nothing with him. I don't, man, I don't see nothing wrong with uh getting the air fryer out here. Like, why are we doing this? Nothing wrong with it. Hey, y'all, I, I stay telling them stuff all the time. All the time. You wouldn't believe it. Yeah, like this morning, he said, I'm glad you go get my coffee. <laughs> yeah, oh. Uh, I told Stephen, I and Grandma both. I've told them both. I said, don't wait till you ready to go live to pick that phone up. I said, you go on and get it. You go on and get it ready. And, you know, like where y'all get a notification now. Now, I know everybody don't just break and run and come and see it. But at least you know he's fitting to go live in a few minutes, see. And I try to tell them all this stuff all the time. Yeah. I ain't seen simple things with Tammy yet. Hey, Trisha. She probably laid up from that banana split I seen her eat. Y'all got everybody. Hey, Connie. Y'all got everybody get, going to get banana split. Hey, you know, uh, I think Tammy's got an air fryer in there, but y'all, she, I mean, she don't, she likes to eat, but she don't care that much about cooking. I mean, I, and, uh, I mean, she'll, she'll, she'll cook a meal every now and then, but she'll also cook a hamburger and a hot dog, too, you know. You remember you asked me about brushes, Royal Lankin. Uh-huh. That's the one. Let, let me see them, Steve. I put some brushes on Stephen's, uh, Wish list, like, I think I told y'all that. PJ Manley. Yeah, yeah. You know y'all. 
you can't depend on that notification. That's that's really the reason it's so important to, uh, for everybody to know that you're gonna go like that. You're gonna go live, you know, on a certain day and all that. Yeah. I, I mean, you know, there's people that ain't worried about, it, but there's people that they want to watch, you know. Hey, they say they good or call it the hamburgers in the air fryer. Bella? Hey, Bella. Yes, yeah, Stephen done an amazing job. Glenda Sue. Glenda Sue? Where you been? I didn't get no notification either, Glenda. And I was sitting right here. I seen him when he hit the live button. Yeah, it was delayed a little bit. Hey, y'all, camp. Mm. Uh, listen, I mean, you know, none of us ain't perfect, you know. And, I, I mean, I, I, y'all, I'll be honest with you, I just let Tammy do whatever she wants to do. I mean, she'll ask me what I want and all that, and I said, whatever you cook, I'll eat. I mean, I, mean, I, you know, I let her do anything she wants to do, you know. All right. Got a, got an autograph church. This is going to be for Miss June. She wanted a, a white burnt church. She lives in North Carolina. This is you right here, little lady. Hey, Sherry. How about that right there? Pretty, ain't it? And I seen that about the... I do a good job behind the scenes. I appreciate that. Yeah, I left yesterday and went in there and started working on Stephen's video. I, uh... Nah, what it done... What it done is it went in there and put about four corn dogs in the microwave. <laughs> Yeah, y'all, I don't know what I'd do without a microwave. Oh, gosh. Sand that paint off and burn it again. Fiona. Fiona. I think that's how you say that. Hey, Cindy. Well, the truth about it is I wasn't really worried about it. I planned on fixing it. I just, but you're right. Thank you, Patricia. It, Patricia, I think I've seen you on the comment before uh, saying something about me. I, I, pre I do appreciate it. <coughs> yeah, got to have a microwave. There it is. Done the trick. Good morning, Linda. All Linda right. Looney. <laughs> Next, we got Miss Sherry Smile from Missouri. Smiley. Hey, that's pretty good, ain't it? Let's do, let's do her one. Now, you, know, you know, they kind of a different group of people, and I said it before. And, and uh, what I'm saying, y'all, is, and, and I've tried it more than once. When I get in front of that camera, I forget my name. I can't talk, <laughs> save my life. I ain't 108 degrees in Texas. Woo! You know, we went up there to Clark's Hill. I thought it was going to be real rough. But, uh, you know, but like the heat, you know. Uh, but, but I mean, it, it, it really wasn't bad, you know. That, that wind blows on them lakes, Sandy you know. Pete. Paid for shipping in white truck. Aw, thank you so much, sweetie. I'm glad you got the truck. I hope you like it. Uh, it was a pleasure gifting it to you. All right, Miss uh, Miss Sherry didn't tell me how to paint her church, but guess what? I'm gonna do it. Stephen, good morning, Cindy. Great thumbnail today. Good morning, Cindy. 
Crystal, good morning. Everybody hit the like button for Steve. I had this buddy, and I, I mean, I still do. You know, I've known him a long time, boy, and he... He... Uh, Man, he would like, he would dog his employees out like people that, that he liked. And you can't do that, y'all. I mean, they'll quit. Yeah. I mean, they, I mean, they, I mean, they bringing in a million dollars a year for kind of a small company. But I mean, he, He's liable, liable to get mad about a screwdriver that's missing or a drill or something just dumb. I was going to tell more, but, but I decided not to. But anyway, y'all seen people like that? Just overreact. Yeah, do you know what I'm talking about, Stephen? I yeah. mean, I, I mean, just making money, hand over fist. Just, I mean, making money, and just get mad about something stupid. Glenda Sue, after all this time, you saying where's the like button? <laughs> Vanessa, I can't tell it because it hits too close to it. Click, it hits too close to home with Stephen. I just, I, I, I'm gonna try not to aggravate Stephen. Like everything I say, everything I say seems like I'm talking about somebody, and sometimes I am, and sometimes I'm just talking. Thank you, Miss Bell. Stephen and Danny, you're doing an awesome job. Thank you so much. Okay. I guess we're going to have to excuse you, Glenda Sue, since you're old. <laughs> Grandma called me up. And she done been telling me for about a week, and I've been kind of listening to her, but but uh, I can tell she's making it pretty good, but her, but her computer done started doing something else now, and, and I can tell it, uh, I can tell it that, that uh, she needs to bring it up here where I can get everything straightened it out, straightened out again. She'll be explaining to me what's wrong, and I, yeah. I can't even hardly understand even what she's talking about, you know. Saying like Joe Biden, you know, talking about, you know, the thing, the thing. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about, the thing. <laughs> Woo-hoo, found it, Glenda Sue. All right, thank you. Glenda Sue, I like that name. You know what, I like Sherry, too. I like a bunch of names. I'm going to tell y'all some names I like as I see them on here. I like Vanessa. Vanessa sounds like a uh, long, dark hair and on the cover of a magazine. Don't. Like Rich with one of them, hat, one of them hats like Fever wears. Yeah, one of them big, pretty hats. Chris and Whistler. Oh, tell her, and tell I can, her, she's, hers is coming up. And I can see her pretty good, you know, look like one of them pretty women now. If grandma's up here, she'd get on to me about calling a woman pretty. But the other women can say she's pretty, but I just can't do it. But thank you, Miss Trisha. Grandma told me the other day, you know, I asked her, why did she name 
me and my brother, Tony and Danny. And, you know, about two weeks passed, and she, she told me that she wanted to know why her mama named her Helen. And, uh, I, you know, we kind of talked a minute, and she said, but, I mean, I didn't know she was going to die at age 47, you know. Thank you, Miss June. Oh, uh, June said, "Thank you, Stephen." Is she on there? Yeah, June Man Kavitz. Here you go, June. This is it. <laughs> you beautiful burnt church. How about that? I don't stuck my arm in the paint. Hey, Norma, I didn't. I didn't see you on the comments, but I see somebody speaking to you, so it'll normal. Normal's a regular. Norma Jean. Love your voice. Thank you, Glenda Sue. I you know, uh I heard I heard uh I think like a couple people uh say that they couldn't hear me singing. Y'all the reason if you couldn't hear me, I was there. I was in there. But I sound exactly like Steven, see? Our voices is the same perfect pitch. Yeah, when, when uh, we talk on the phone, people say they can't tell us apart. You hear the birds? Oh, that's beautiful sound. Oh yeah, y'all. I, I put some paint on uh Stephen's wish list too, and it ain't for the people that it ain't for the people that's barely getting by. It's, it's for the people that can afford it. And and y'all, uh, the reason that wish list is there is because there's some people that want to help. And it, it, yeah, Monique says she heard me. But, uh, there's people that want to help it. It, it took me a long time, a, a long time ago. There's people that want to help. And, 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 and you're supposed to just let them help. Yeah, and you offend them if you don't. Yeah, that's right. Woman. There was a. Let me tell you this. You agree. I was going down the interstate. Hey, and I, Rosemary. And I seen a motorhome pulled over. And I seen an elderly man and woman standing out there by. You know, it was a nice motorhome. You could, uh... I mean, I instantly pulled over and backed up the shoulder. And I went up there and, like, you know, he had like a Navy hat on. And, you know, I just didn't just want to run up there. I didn't want to scare him, you know. So I got out and I kind of stayed back and I said, can I, can I help you? Is there anything I can do? And uh, I noticed the man's head, the... The guy's head was bleeding. He had blood running down his head. And uh, what happened is he, he had a blowout, and the, the tire slapping around in the fender well, it it tore the fender guard up, and hey, it made a mess, y'all. And he was up in there trying to get that tire out of the from in a bind, and he hit a screw. A ribbit on his head and I mean like I I had some baby wipes like hey when you have youngins and you done got my age you keep some baby wipes with you everywhere you go it ain't even for the baby no more <laughs> but anyway 
I had a jack and I had my impact on the truck. Uh, he had a he had one of them little butterfly jacks like what fell on John. Hey, I scissor. a scissor jack. I put my jack under there, jacked it up, took the tire off, put his other tire on, loaded it up in the truck, and uh, I told his wife, you know, I was like, G see about him, I got this. Uh, just get in the air conditioner, I'll take care of it, and this leads back to what you were saying. That man, when I got done, tried to pay me, and... I didn't accept this money. I told him, I said, no, sir, like, I done this out of my heart. You don't owe me nothing. And uh, if you was, if it was my grandma, I wish somebody would stop and do the same. I said, just make sure you get another tire on that rim before you strand it. And, uh, you know, I thought about that. And... Like, I thought about that later on, and I was, it kind of upset me that I didn't take the guy's money. I didn't want the money. I did it out of kindness, but it's so funny because his wife sent me a letter. Y'all, I am I am not making this up. When I drove off, I had my company name on the side of my truck, and she Googled it and looked me up and wrote me a letter. And told me how thankful she was to have met me and uh, my kindness and uh, it warmed my heart and y'all that, that was very special and uh, you never know when you can touch somebody you know and uh, that pulling over helping somebody you know hey they say you don't supposed to do that but if that's like how I go you know hey the good Lord knows it I hate to see, like, kids and elderly. I just, I feel obligation to help. Did I ever show you that letter? No, but I, I know about it, Stephen. Y'all, uh, see, one time when Stephen was little, you know, mine and Tammy's money was tight, you know. Uh, but we would always have these youngest birthday party, you know, uh, not a big blowout, but we would always have friends and stuff over, the grandparents and stuff. And one of the grandparents told me uh, she would buy the cake. And, and I mean, that made me mad. <laughs> I, I mean, it really did. And, and uh, that's kind of when I learned about People want to help. And Tim, Tim is like the one that got me straightened up about that, you know. But there, there is people that, that want to help. And then there's people that accuse you of begging for help. <laughs> But I learned, you know, uh, Tammy was a Sunday school teacher there one time there. And they, they had these, they was gathering up boxes of food, you know, canned food. And they was going to give it to somebody. And they give, Tammy come on, had that big old box of stuff and said, you know what I mean? And that, that aggravated me too. And I talked to her and she said, that's who the youngest wanted to give it to. They wanted to give it to me. Thank you, Miss Ellen. And, you know, I just, uh, so I kind of learned, you know, if somebody wants to help you, Sometimes it's just better to shut up and let them help you, you know? Hey, y'all, I'm fitting to go get me and Stephen something to drink. What you want, Stephen? 
surprise me. Okay. I'm talking about, like, always surprise me. You don't never have to ask. Oh my goodness, look how beautiful this is. And it's not even done. Oh wow, look at that. This is, uh, this is Miss Sherry Smiley from Missouri. She didn't tell me how to do it, so I'm doing my own touch. fan back there is getting me. Y'all ain't my daddy sweet mystery man. He's a sweet man. He's genuine hearted. He is an exceptional daddy. He never daddy never put anybody in front of me. When it come time to go fishing, I was in the front of that boat, not his buddies. He never made me stay home for them. Monique said if you didn't get back, she was going to be mad. Ugh. Boy, look like everybody's saying all kind of good stuff. Who knew when I built this craft table right here, it, it had so much stuff on it. Man, I want you to look at this one of a kind mamma jamma right here. Hey y'all. I look out of my family and I always have now. Look how pretty that is. Miss Shirley Smiley from Missouri. This is yours, sweetie. Thank you so much for your love and support and being kind to my family. Thank you so much for even just, just even simply wanting uh, a birdhouse that I made. Uh, thank you, Crystal. Miss Vaughn, thank you. Ooh, let me let me show this one again. Kind of compare them. Hey, ain't they pretty? Ah, hey, Monique. I was kidding. Hey, thank y'all. Thank y'all. You ready to do another one? Ready to do another one. You know, I told you we'd have parties for these youngers. You know, birthday parties. And like I say, it wouldn't be no big old blowout, you know. But it would just, it would just be a few of their friends and, and the grandparents, you know. That's right. And I was over there working on a job one day. Me and Stephen, uh, we don't work for contractors. We don't, we don't want to work for contractors. They, they, they nearby. There's a lot of them that smart alecks, you know. But uh, this is when I was young and I was just starting and I was over there working and I was doing a roof and but I mean I, you know I knew I had to go because of Stephen's birthday party you know and that man was trying to tell me to he was trying to make out like uh, I mean I don't remember exact words y'all I'm kind of an exact word kind of person but he was talking about like the the roof was more important than the birthday party, and Boy. and the roof wasn't more important than the birthday party, y'all. The roof was all right. Hey, I can tell you, that didn't go over all that great, did it? You know that. I, you know I went back the next day and finished the roof. I, I didn't have but a, about an hour, or so. <coughs> Look at that. 
SH with a heart. All right, let's see who's next on the list. Okay, hold on, Steve. Uh, Miss Fawn S. just sent you set of a uh, set from the wish list. Oh, sweet. A paint set. A paint set. Thank you so much. Hey, I'll definitely put it to good use. Y'all uh, actually think I'm one of kind of... S.H. is my daughter's initials. Hey, hey, that's beautiful. I just think I'm one of them kind of person that kind of reads backwards. Tammy said she thought she was like that too. All right, uh, Lori Foster from Cape Coral, Florida. Are you ready? Okay, Steve, be looking out for Connie's Crafty Corner. She sent you a Facebook message. All right. She said she's in love and she's in love and she's ready to get married. <laughs> and and then said by the way she wants a bird out. Now I made that up. Y'all know that same man was like telling me about the about the uh you know like don't worry about the birthday party. I was supposed to meet that man over there to get paid. I had done done two houses. And it was per it was some pretty serious money to me, you know. And I was over there waiting for him, and I called his wife up. She said he's gone to Lake Sinclair. When uh, you know what I mean? I needed my money, y'all. It ain't like I could just float along good. I needed my money. We me and Jamie was young. I mean, you needed your money and needed it now. And, uh, I was just about to get that man when I finally caught up to him. He said, you know you about to talk your way out of some work, don't you? I said, <laughs> I said, if I got to run you down to get paid, I don't want to do nothing for you. Oh, People man. don't like to run their money down, y'all. Heck, no. We don't usually mind working, but when it's time to get paid, by George, we want our, our payment. Yeah, you know, hey, you know, y'all, you know, Stephen lived out in that other little small town, and he's liable to go over there and do something that was something that's three hundred dollars, and you know, be at home. And they could have made arrangements to pay him. But then like, he had to spend 40 more dollars in gas to go back to their house. Yep. And people do that bad, y'all. Yep. Or, or when you're cleaning up your tools, they drive, pull out of the parking lot. They leave. Hey, y'all. Hey, uh, Connie put Stevens off. Uh, Facebook page there on there. And you know, I told y'all I was going to put a link on there today for that, that, uh, the saving electricity video I got on YouTube. I had a lady message me last night and, t and say, tell your daddy I started cutting my coffee pot off after watching his video. She said, I'm excited to see the difference. Hey, it'll make a difference. You you take, uh, you know, I mean, heat your coffee up in the coffee pot the way you always do, and then unplug it and then pour it in the microwave, pour it in the cup and put it in the microwave. I can't tell no difference myself. But them coffee pots, they burn a pretty good bit of electricity. Hey, Diane, you know, I see that about, uh, uh, you have trouble sleeping. Uh, you know, I mean, I, I reckon that's bad in a way, but it's, but, but it's also bad in a way to, like you, uh, 
So let me let me see if I can simplify. You can get a lot done if you ain't sleeping much. That's right. So I guess it can be good and bad. That's for sure. Uh, you know, I don't know if Stevens got any bird houses on Facebook, but Stevens on there, and y'all, uh, you you can do that private message thing, you know. And that's where he can uh, take your address and everything. And, and you know, I will tell y'all about this. And I've told Stephen about this a while back. And what, what, now, we ain't got no loads here. Uh, all we got is the Home Depot, Dublin. Y'all, I, I looked on the, I looked on the uh, Home Depot. Like trying to see, figure out how to put, uh, you know, uh, what you call them little cars to give cars? Yes. I looked on there and I didn't see how to do it. And, but y'all, I I seen a video. I think Mama showed it too. Mama seen it too. And said there's a new scam going on. And and I'll tell you what they doing, you know. Uh and they they giving stuff away. But then that person's contacting you back. No, no. Uh say like Stephen. They cloning they would clone Stephen and then send a message trying to act like they Stephen, except that they asking you your banking information. Yeah, I'll never ask anybody their banking stuff. So, Stevens never asking, uh, you, you know, you have to give me address because you, you got to know where to ship the stuff to, you know, but there's all kind of scammers out there, you know. That's for sure. So y'all just beware, you know, don't, don't tell nobody nothing uh, about nothing. Nothing from nothing. The IRS or they not going to call you over the phone. They going to send a letter, you know. And 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 I know y'all. I know most of y'all I know almost all of y'all know all this stuff, but but they pretty clever, you know. Yeah. They uh, one of them fooled Tammy. Oh, I hear birds all over the place now. I talked to Glenda there, y'all, Whitworth, before. I have talked to Glenda on the phone. And she told me, you know, that here's what she told me, and, and I've thought about it more than once. She said, she was talking about women losing their husbands. And then, she, and then she said, on the other hand, like she just can't believe somebody letting a good man get away. Well, you you can't help but say it, can you? So, uh, how you know who I'm talking about? See, that's what I'm talking about. Why? That that is a bunch of people, cuz. Well, I mean, you're right. That is a bunch of people. I, I mean, you see it and you hear about it all the time. 
Yeah, yeah, well, I'm sorry. And you, and you know it, too. I see good women all the time say their husband, they, they be gave 25 years of their life and then he go do something stupid and they just left, the, left out the dry. Explain that, because I, I, I didn't understand that. Women that be married 25 years and husband go out and do something dumb and then they divorce. And they put all that time into that. And well, yeah, you know, I mean, there's a, there's a lot of that, that goes on too. Yeah, I, I mean, uh, a lot of times men get stupid around 40 years old. But what I'm, what I'm really talking about is like men dying, like good husbands dying. Yeah. And I mean, the, the woman will give everything they own to have them back. Yeah. And then you got some that'll just. So perfectly good men. I mean, I, I don't even want them. Yeah, I see that, Benita. And and you know I, you know, in that roof of it, I worked for a bunch of. A bunch work for a bunch of elderly women. I had so much work, I could just pick who I wanted to work for, you know. I couldn't do all I had to do. And I would hear them ladies talking, you know. They would love, they would love for me to sit out on the porch with them and talking. And I learned then a long time ago, you know, that they... They can't replace the man they had, and they don't even want to try. Yeah, I see that, man. Yeah, they, they's a bunch, you know, I don't know, uh, y'all, I really ain't no ladies, ladies man. Uh, but a lot of men, I don't know what else them, you know, they get, they get stupid, uh, you know, at around 40 years old. With exception of me. I don't feel dumb. But anyway, it's... You know what I mean? It's amazing, you know what I mean? If you sit down and think about it, you know? Like, like I really don't even like to think about it too much, you know? That's right. You know what I mean? You know, like, what would you give, you know, to have that man back and, and, and that man will have, you know, that husband, he'll have, he'll have you spoiled, he'll go up there, he'll, I see it all the time, and y'all do too, he'll get out there and uh, go up there and get you a, a ice cream, won't even get himself one, and walk over there and open your car door up and hand it to you. Yep. Make sure I got this right. Aqua blue white roof. Yep. Try to get you that ring that you can't even afford. That he can't even afford. Yep. Reminds you of that George Strait song. Now I was reading here what Glenn said. Oh, that's what I'm talking about, Glenn. 
they don't even they don't even want to try to they don't even want to try to replace. They can't replace. Yeah, I know you're kidding, uh, uh, Glenda, uh, about Stephen, but, uh, you know, all the women say that, you know, but, but we all know that, uh, you know, all of us normal people know everybody's kidding. It's all right to say you love Stephen, and and if I was 10 years younger or whatever, you know, they don't nobody pay that no attention. You know, you know what I'm talking about, paying attention in a bad way. Well, there's a difference in loving somebody and being in love, and there's just a difference. Yeah, that, hey, David, that's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah, I mean, there's some bad ones out there. You know, there's some bad men out there. There's some bad women out there. And and y'all all know that, too. But like when you got it made, why rock the boat? Hey, Kathy. Can't you just order the birdhouse, too? Oh, sweet. The old-fashioned way, so I think she's must be mailing you a check. Tell her to put in the, the tell her to put in there how she wants it on the screen. Okay, Tennessee Iris says Stephen's absolutely right says there's a difference between loving someone and being in love with someone. And uh, that's also one of my sayings too, you know, you can love your dog, you know. Well, I absolutely love everybody in here. Ain't no question about it. Man, the sweetest, beautifulest people I ever seen in my life didn't even know it existed. Like grandma, <laughs> grandma introduced me to that. Even though Nan, uh, even though Miss Bell didn't say your name, I think she's talking about you. She just handcuffed you. Hey, that's what you do, y'all. That's what you do. That's what you do. Uh, y'all, you know, I could, I could talk about that all day long about replacing us, but I, I work for these elder women, and they was a, they was some kind of little flower group they had over there, a bunch of little rich women, you know. And I work for them, you know. And flower, let's say flower something other. They had a club. It wasn't a. It wasn't like the Red Hat Club or something? It was something like that, but it wasn't Red Hat, but it was some kind of a little garden club that the little ladies had. All of them, uh, all of them got plenty of money, you know. So... You got a husband who takes off the trash, he cleans, he cooks, he buys everything. He... Why, why rock the boat?
Well, good for you, Vanessa. Vanessa's been married 15 years. Oh, wow. Good job on that. I know everybody's doing their part, man. Uh, you walked out, Vanita? You walked out or he walked out? I, I raised four kids for 17 years. I finally walked out. Yeah, I mean, I mean, you know, I mean, I'm sure it was for a good reason. I mean, I see you say he, he like, messed around and done some stuff. But, yeah, they did too. Lisa Renee. Lisa Renee said, if you don't know where the like button is, you need to take time to find it right now. <laughs> well, thank you so much. Hey, y'all, and I also like to take this video and share it to Facebook. Oh, that, that'll help Steve more than anything. Yep, it helps get the word out and helps, uh, helps me reach more people where I can bless more people and give them some positivity in their life and make them smile and uh, make them feel good about themselves and, you know, look, something to look forward to. Just, just get on here and we fellowship and we do crafts and paint and build and don't forget to sing in concert. Like that's that's happening this week. We ain't had Bentley's birthday party yet. It, uh, I'm having to work around my daughter's schedule to where she can be here. But that's coming up this week. We're gonna be doing karaoke at the party on Facebook Live. So make sure you add me. Add me on Facebook, send me a private message, and say, here for the concert. Because if you don't say, here for the concert, there's a pretty good chance it won't get accepted because I don't accept everybody that comes in because I have hundreds and hundreds come through. And they go to my spam folder. But if I see concert in private message, I know exactly what that means, and I know you're a real person, and I'll get you added. So don't forget that. Magnolia, I seen your comment there, but I couldn't break in on Stephen there. Uh oh, Piggy. Piggy told me, hey Piggy, don't don't retract the miss. She told me I can't find the like button. <laughs> and then retracted it. Ah, uh, Belva Smith said she shared it on Facebook. Thank you so much. Hey, y'all, that, you know what I mean? Won't everybody, won't all your friends look at it, uh, you know, every, everything you post there, but these people, they's, they's a little handful that'll look at it, you know? Hey, you never know when you can change somebody's life. Just something simple as sharing a video or, or adding it to your timeline and if it reaches one person, if it reaches one person a month and can make a difference in somebody's life, I mean, how beautiful is that? Hey, y'all. Shirley Nash. Y'all would be proud of her. <laughs> Y'all would be proud of her. She teach her, she teach her ex a lesson. <laughs> How about that? Now that is funny. I'm talking about y'all be standing up there cheering. <laughs> if you knew the story. <laughs> Miss Shirley Nash is a sweet lady. Yeah, I like Shirley. Miss Shirley said, uh, I see you post that, Miss Bill. I'm, you know, I mean, you know, I mean, sometimes I miss, you know. She 
She didn't say burn this thing, but I'm fitting to burn it and add some character to it. And I also seen you retracted your message, Miss Bill. Y'all, I just can't, I just can't, uh, I can't see everything and, and I sure can't read while I'm talking, you know. Say the nurses keep coming in there watching with you, Michelle. Yeah, we see you, Nancy. Uh, Ian Bell. We see you, Ian Bell. Lay it on me, write it in big right, and boy, I can see it. <laughs> Dean and I have been married for over 40 years. We got married at 15 and three kids, and we are, are 55, so we've been married a very long time. Yeah, I've been married forever, too. Okay, Joel. Yeah, y'all. Uh, y'all can send Stephen a message and Stephen ain't got no strings attached. I was a single mom for 10 years, wanted to concentrate on my boys. I had to give up on finding someone. When my current husband came into my life, 41 years and counting. Well, that's congratulations, though. Hey, y'all, I, you know, uh, solitary confinement, you know, is real bad, you know. Yeah. I hear the birds. Yep. Benita said she would have given anything to have her husband back. I believe you too. I mean, I know because I mean, I ain't just started thinking about this five minutes ago, y'all. I, I remember it in the roofing business, you know. Them women, uh, you know, a lot of them women, they would, they would, uh, say I remind them of their husband and stuff like that. You know how that goes. All right. Miss uh, Lori Foster from Cape Coral, Florida. Here's your beautiful birdhouse. You want an aqua with a white roof. And I burnt the trim on it to make it just have a little touch of just to have a little touch of it all. How about that right there? Yeah, I see you. I'm right here. She said she didn't mind being alone. Uh, I don't think Grandma does neither. I don't think it bothers her a bit. But, uh... Here, here's what I've always thought, y'all, and I... I mean... I just think it's nice like to uh like to have somebody to get out there and grill a uh grill a hamburger with or something like that, you know, and maybe watch T V and then get up and go home or whatever, you know. Yeah, I hear you, Connie, I see that. Good job, Stephen. Let us go. Doug, Liam, where you going? You leaving me? She's probably going to ride her motorcycle. Doug, Liam, got a motorcycle? I think she's got two Harleys. <laughs> hey, Monique, that's kind of the way Grandma is. Grandma get mad you try to set her up. Something like fist bite. I said, Grandma, I met this man at Bingo. I think 
you ought to go eat with him. I'm talking about like he had, had me ducking and diving. <laughs> Done got after me with the fly swatter. Look at that, y'all. Just think, Hodge. See you later, Dove Lynn. Yeah, yeah, I love that. Yeah, we'll see you. We'll see you, Dove Lynn. Glenn the Sioux says she's back. I seen one lady yesterday on the comment. She said, uh, she said she couldn't get her housework done. Uh, Miss Teresa Bryant said, uh, from Laneham, MD. Teresa Bryant said she wanted a church. She said she wanted a birdhouse. She, uh, any, my choice that, uh, she, she would love anything I'd do. Well, that's sweet of you. I want to thank you for trusting me with the project. I'm going to fix you up right now. I was telling Stephen about a woman a long time ago telling me. I think it was her boyfriend or something other, but they had done been together a long time, you know. And and from time to time I would hear her talking about him, you know. But everything she would say would be good, you know. That, uh, and I asked her one day, I said, well, and this is what I told Stephen this morning. I said, well, why'd you, I mean, why'd you break up with him? And uh, she told me lack of sense. She told me lack of sense. That's what she told me. All right. She said, use my judgment. <laughs> Glenn the Sioux. Husband said to watch y'all or he's getting a divorce. I can't decide. <laughs> y'all, I'm somebody I hate hot weather, boy. Are you okay out here? Right oh, now? yeah, yeah, I mean, it, yeah, it's good out here. Yeah. But, like, you know, I... I need to get some, some, uh, some of them vines cut over there. Grandma used to, like, come up here and cut them. Miss Bell said she was a hog. Hey, I hear you, Connor. Ain't that the truth? Connor talking about, you know, one of the requirements he is must have a driver's license. Connie said she went she uh went to the grocery store, got the stuff to make a banana split. She said, I want you to know by the time I got home it was all melted. She said she said, I didn't put it in the refrigerator and wait on it to get back hard, neither. I just fixed it just like it was. Okay, Miss Vanita said. Now, Miss Vanita gets what I'm saying. Danny, you are so right. There is women that treat good husbands so bad. Y'all, that is what I'm saying. I guess just a sport or something. That's their hobby. I tell you what, I ain't never liked, and it ain't too cute to me. I ain't never liked somebody to get around their friends and start taking slaps at you. It's a kick.
I've seen people do that that I know, and I, and I don't like to see that happen. It ain't too cute to be little somebody. Happy birthday this Sunday, David. Oh yeah. Man, that is. Ask Monique what she thinks about that pretty color. Okay, I got something I need to read here, Steve. Okay. Will you make my mama one? She wanted one until before she passed. I think that big jar of paint looks good. Paint it all till. But do all the trimming in white. Please sign my mom loves Stephen. Please oh yeah. Sign it uh and her mama loved you. And who is that? Wait wait let me make Please sign my mom look my mom loves Stephen. Uh, are you saying you, you want it signed? My mom loves Shirley Nash. Aww. Are you saying for Stephen to sign it? My mom loves Stephen. Is that right? Or you just want Stephen to sign it? Uh, just, just tell me how you want Stephen to sign it. Okay, just sign it, Stephen. I wasn't quite sure what she was saying there. Well, it'd be an honor to do that. Man, it's Stephen Hodge. Jack said the church is gorgeous. Thank you, Jackie. Ain't she sweet? Stephen, I love you, Danny, and all your family. Who said that? Oh, uh, that's, uh, let, let me see, it moved on me. Vanita. Thank you, Vanita. We love you too. Hey, we sure do. Oh yeah. Boy, that's pretty right there. That's some pretty red. Hey, y'all, Tammy never gets mad. I mean, I never get mad, neither. <laughs> Is that right? Now, how many times you see me mad, huh? What about the time you kicked the jet food store doors? You kicked them right in the middle and slung them back. They both slung open like back bent them. You know why I done that? Do, do you know why I done that? Why? What I done, y'all, is I karate kicked the double <laughs> doors. <laughs> he did. I karate kicked the double doors at the uh, jet food store. Uh, I gave the man a hundred dollars, and and uh, he's gonna try to keep the money. He, he, he said I didn't give him a hundred. And uh, I about turned that place into a car wash. Is that the guy that shorted me? No. I about turned it into a car wash and, and karate kicked the doors on the way out. I, hey, I like to tell them all. But the owner called me up mad about me kicking them doors. I knew the owner. Good morning, Deborah. Stephen? Good morning, Deborah. I nod. Hey, y'all, I like, you know, uh, 
I mean, like, I just love to do anything, you know? Yeah. Who knows that better than me? Oh, I, I, I got my money back. Can't even take your eyes off you. You know, he, I mean, what he's doing, he always, I mean, he's going to keep the money. And he, and, uh, like, I raised so much hell, he's talking about he was going to see how it turned out the register checked out. When they counted the register. Yeah, when they counted the register and, uh, and I mean, man, that's probably, man, that's probably 50 years ago. It was $100 a lot of money, especially to me. 50 years ago? It wasn't 50 years ago because I remember that. Let's see, wait a minute, I'm, yeah, I mean, I was like 18 or 19, son. Oh, well, then you talking about something I don't even remember then. Yeah, I mean, I was 18 or 19 years old. Hey, William's doing good, y'all. I talked to him. Uh, I think it was yesterday I talked to him a few minutes. He was talking about I let you go. I know you're doing something, but I think I wasn't doing nothing. I think he's the one that had to go do something. Yeah. You know, them big brushes are nice, but... You always need a little brush to trim. Yeah, I, I, yeah, I know that. I thought about that. Hey, y'all, yeah, I mean, yeah. I, you know, I was at the fair one time, and I lost. Yeah, I was doing something, and I, I took the gun and slammed it on the, on the counter. Boy, that man at that fair, he got mad now. <laughs> I was playing a game and... And whatever I was doing, I lost and slammed that gun down. I, it's some kind of a gun. You know, I was young, you know what I mean? Shoot star out of a... Shoot star out with a BB gun or something? I think it was a water gun you're shooting a little clown's mouth. Oh. I lost and I took the gun and just slammed it down. Tammy could, Tammy's about the only one that like could ever bring me back to reality. Bring me back to reality, yeah. Yeah, I have, I have a meal of that, you know, growed up and, and got some sense, you know. One of the, one of the things that I, one of the things I've learned that that the, the most and and I can tell all old folks has done learnt this you know all of us all of us old folks and I can tell this is something that 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 we've all learnt that you know we don't jump to conclusions we've learnt not to jump to conclusions uh, about even something can look one way, you know, but we've learned not to jump to conclusions and about who done this or whatever, you know. We don't, we don't jump to conclusions. <laughs> yeah. Hey, I got mad about that man keeping that hundred dollars now.
Yeah, I've, I've come way down, y'all. Do you hear the birds, Hodge? Uh, wait a minute now, what, does, the the Tammy carry a, oh, I, I got you now. Hey, you, you know, uh, no, nah, she was just like, uh, you know, I mean, I wouldn't, if I got started, I was pretty rough, you know, but, but like, I, uh, Tammy, like, uh, she slapped my jaw more than once now. <laughs> hey, man. That's funny. But see, I wouldn't do nothing back to her, you know. Monique said she loves the red, Stephen. I like that, too. That's a good color red. I can't remember the the one you done for the, the, the preacher. Yes, sir. I like that color, you know. Uh, is that it there, the purple over there? It seemed like it was a different color. It was this color. Yeah. Hey, y'all, I'm going to sit in and take a break. And, uh, Stephen might pause in there talking, but, uh, I'm going I'm to sit back and, and let Stephen talk here. I look at the comments. You're about to call the rat. Hey, you know, uh, you know, I see that there, Debbie. Now, see, that's what Tammy's daddy thought I was. Except I was good to Tammy, you know. But, you know, he, he told me, uh, I, yeah, I told y'all that the other day, Dan, on Grandma's video. He actually come to me and told me that I was wrong. I was wrong about you, you know. But I was pretty rough, but I was good to Timmy. All right. Here it is, y'all. Beautiful red shirt. I burn it. I love the I love the wood grain patterns in it when you burn it. Got it autographed. How about that? Uh, thank you, Nicole. Crystal Nicole said that's beautiful. Lynn Griffin, thank you. This right here is... I think I said... Yeah, Teresa Bryant from Langham, M.D. Uh, thank you, Michelle, Miss Annette. Daily Bread, Norma Green, thank y'all. M. Wells. Crystal Nettles, thank you. Vanessa Johnson, Sandra, farm wife, Monique, thank you so much. Hey, these things, look at that, y'all. How pretty. <laughs> Lynn Lynn. Griffin. Lynn Griffin, do I still have your address and note? I... I do. I don't throw any of that away. CDJJ, are you still watching? CDJJ. Thank you, Miss Shirley. Aw. Crystal Ann, thank you. Hey, thank you so much for being sweet, Miss Kathy Fields. 
Debbie Delano. Ah. Thank y'all so much. Miss Sharon, love the torch look. Oh yes, me too. Me too. Thank you so much. Patricia from California. Nice job on the birdhouse. Daily Bread 7. I love to have the purple one. The Daily Bread just got on. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Ah. Uh, what did Miss Green say? I missed it. I missed it. Ah. Right. I don't see it, Steve. Let me know if you see CDJJ in there. I don't see that about Miss Green. I might have her name wrong. See, Norma Green says she loved the purple one, too. All right. Ready to do another one? I, I enjoy doing this for y'all. I love that y'all watch. I, I love the fact that y'all in chat and y'all are conversating back and forth. I think it's a beautiful thing. Everybody gets along so good. Everybody's sweet. Did Lois, what state you live in? You want to know how much it costs? What state you live in, Lord? Yeah. Yeah, they saying CDJJ was gone. I thought she left a while ago. New Jersey. New Jersey. Ash. It's probably on up the higher shipping scale in New Jersey. I don't know. Uh, uh, we just say ballpark twenty dollars to cover shipping. But I don't charge to build them, and I don't charge for the, the paint and the wood. You see, and you see Lynn Griffin's message there, Steve? I do not. It's gone. I need to know how much more I need to send. There was money. In the note. Oh, uh, that's uh, Lynn Griffin. Ah. Uh. Okay, tell Dolores how to she orders uh, a birdhouse, Steve. Mr. Dolores, you can go on my home page of YouTube and there'll be a link for my PayPal. You'll see the Facebook icon. You'll see uh, a couple different things. But click on that PayPal and you just go in there. Tell me exactly what you want, what color you want it painted, and leave your address in it. And that's a really good way for me to keep track of who's bought what 
it it's all goes to one place it's a lot easier to keep up with Daily, daily bread. I didn't see your message. Ask me it again, and I'll, I'll look at. I'll look here. Hey, 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 Pamela. It ain't hot out here today. Oh man. And a woman won two million Shirley Nash had a woman won two million dollars on a scratch off in her town. Oh dog. Hey Craig from Athens, Georgia. Let me tell you something funny. Yeah. Miss Angela Chung sent me five dollars. She said, "Here's five dollars. Go buy a five-dollar lottery ticket. You're gonna win millions, and you can keep it all." Uh, <laughs> hey, I believe her. I tried it. I didn't win nothing, <laughs> but I felt real good about it. Trying to wait on daily bread to re to repost it. That. Love the red. Oh, uh, thank you. Y'all know how many years I've been trying to get Stephen to build him a shop? And the woodworking equipment. Do you know that I got three houses that's got shops in it that ain't it? So like I... Oh. David Brent said they already done it. Oh. How much would the shipping be for North Carolina? I, it would be like the purple burnt one. Oh, that... Hey, y'all, that... Like right around here, Tennessee and North Carolina and Alabama, shipping's real reasonable. I don't know how Stephen uh, lets y'all know about the shipping. I ain't never asked him. Well, I just basically go with $20, and sometimes it's more and sometimes it's less. It always works out. Okay. I ain't never worried about, you owe me three more dollars. I mean, it all works out. Hey, Carol, I knew you was missing. I knew you was missing, Carol. Carol been out there messing with the flowers. A hey, good day for it. Okay, David said, Grandma needs a church birdhouse in the woods. Grandma sure likes that big old condo. She just a holler another day about it. Yeah, they, they a bunch of them like that purple, Steve. Oh yeah. I, I mean, I've seen that more than once, you know. Have you named a birdhouse in the woods yet? That might be up to Grandma, hasn't it? I have. Oh, you have? This is the name, y'all. Our Peaceful Place is in Mine and Hers. I love the way y'all get on here and chat. I see Grandma's reading y'all's comments, you know, and she don't realize y'all talk, y'all talking to one another. She did, and I think she's done caught on now. But
you can daily bread you can you can uh, mail Stephen a check to that post office box or you can uh, or you can uh, do it uh, on PayPal whatever you're comfortable with whatever you want to do oh I see Okay, let me let me get that straight. When it's hot or not, a tablespoon of orange juice keeps the sugar balanced. I hear you, fam. Uh, I mean, just a tablespoon, like in a glass. Oh, hey, y'all, that team is a good woman. You know, the only thing I feel bad about Tim is tricking her so much. Tricking her? Yeah, I trick Timmy all the time. I used to. I don't trick her too much no more. She would hear me talking about tricking her on the video. And I mean, a couple times she got mad, you know, because she didn't even know I tricked her. Hey, that's okay, Daily Bread. Hey, Daily Bread, just send a description of what you want. And, uh, I reckon you might check out for $20. He has it done a red and white. Red, white, and blue one. Y'all women about to give me a heart attack. Y'all will be just a typing. <laughs> they tell me, slow the chat down. I've looked on here, y'all. I don't I don't see nowhere you can slow this chat down. But hey. Yeah. They different YouTube platforms. Uh, I mean, I know I know some of the names of the other platform, and and uh, I think you can. Yeah, I am. I'm pulling everybody's leg. Uh, but there's different things you can use that does different Woo! things. Like this is just a pretty simple right here. Oh, uh, uh, but there's platforms you can use where you can pull, uh, you know, another uh, person on there with you talking and stuff like that. Grandma's asked me about all that stuff. Hey, John. Grandma's asked me all that stuff, and I told her don't even think about all that, you know, trying to learn all that, you know. There's an Ed and likes the purple. Thank y'all so much. <coughs> so you you realize they're talking about you ain't done a red, white, and blue one, Steve? I do. You got to do that now. Yeah, if you got an extra one, you can do a red, white, and blue, or are they all counted for? I got some. All right, the tables. I'm going to try that right there, uh, Pamela. All a right. tablespoon and a 24-ounce yeti. Here's a green one. How about that? This one right here, I'm going to uh, CDJJ. Sent Miss uh, Pamela. Remember her name? Oh, well, I was reading some. CDJJ sent money and yeah. said he wanted to get Paula. I got it wrote down. I just don't have it in front Ask of them soon if they know about it. They, Do y'all know the sweet lady that's fed ridden at CDJJ? Gladys? Gladys. Yeah, Gladys. Uh, 
I had Miss Gladys's birdhouse made, but this right here is for CDJJ for sending the donation. He sent 50, I mean, she sent $50 for Miss Gladys. And she didn't ask for anything, but I want to send this right here to CDJJ as a thank you for being so kind and wanting to donate. <laughs> Miss Connie, if he does a red, white, and blue, I want it. Okay, Stephen, Tony Z said, hey. Hey, Tony Z. Good morning, Tony Z. Good morning. I know you've been missing, Tony Z. Y'all, uh, see, if you want a phone, things are different than being on a computer. Sharon says she loves the green, the green one. Hold, let me see it, Steve. Let me take a look at it. Ain't they all like just as neat as they can be, ain't they? Yes, sir. They're pretty. Dev loves stitches. I just sent $25. Oh, thank you. Okay. All right. I want a church, aqua roof, and post. Oh, yeah, post. <laughs> she wants the roof and the post aqua. Okay. Boy, y'all think this chat's going fast. Y'all see grandmas, <laughs> and I know a bunch of y'all have, but it be getting up on grandmas now. Connie's cracked the corner. Says she want a red, white, and blue. Yeah, I like them all too, Sherry. It, what would be cool is to have a set of them painted different. That's like what I, when I like something, I tend to overdo it. <coughs> Y'all, I was in there looking at that paint last night on Amazon. Like they, they use, boy, that stuff's high as rip, man. Then I was talking about, you know, up here yesterday, she's talking about, I don't see how Stephen does that. Buy all the stuff. It's because of love and enjoyment and want, want to bless somebody and give them something to smile about. Them. Like, that's the reason. Hey, Kathy, uh, uh, Stephen does build a birdhouse. If you go back and watch yesterday's video, uh, he's on there and he's he's cutting them out. We're showing you what kind of board he's using, and he's cutting them. He cut them out and put all these together yesterday. Oh uh, well, you must be new, Kathy. But uh, glad to have you on here. And this right here is another design I have. Uh, this is what called a simple bird house. I have these available. I have kits available where you can put your own together. I had Miss Miss uh, Donna. Hey, 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 hey. She wanted. Uh, <laughs> she want order two for her and her sister put them together. I thought that was pretty cool. Okay, yeah. Everybody wants a church, Connie. And Joni, it ain't. I mean, yeah. I mean, I'm not sweating. Oh, uh, out here this morning. So it's. It's been good, you know. Yeah, Kathy says she's new, Steve. Well, Kathy, welcome. Is it just Kathy? Oh, uh, let's see. Let me let me look at her last name. 
Kathy Tittle. Kathy Tittle, welcome. Welcome. Nice to have you. And all I know is if you knew you got a lot of content, uh, if you plan on watching it all, you got your work cut out. <laughs> lady messaged me last night and said I'm watching your cooking video is that is that beef or pork she said you about she said I done ate everything in the house watching you cook them squash on that grill hey now them things were good that squash you like squash don't you Arthur? I like fried squash I think that's that color there I like to see. It is. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about, Pam. I couldn't believe how high that paint was. Stephen told me it's went up, you know. And, uh, you know, y'all don't forget, uh, Grandma will be live in the morning at 10 o'clock. Grandma and the Big Show. I'll be down there with her. And sometimes Stephen goes down there, sometimes he don't, he don't, he don't usually go too much. I like Grandma to do like I love Grandma and ain't nothing I wouldn't do for her, but I also like her to have her show. I don't, I mean, I want her to do her, and I don't want her to ever feel like I'm down there just for viewers, because that's not true. Hey, if y'all ever sit around in the living room watching the Price is Right shilling peas and butter beans, like have all your brothers and sisters in there and We used to do that. You know, uh, Grandma's daddy was a farmer. Boy, we'd sell peas and butter beans. Have them, have them laying out on a, a bed. A, a sheet. A sheet. A sheet on the floor. And y'all that's watching this after the Everybody that's watching this after the live chat, uh, Stephen, he's, he's trying to get on the schedule, but you can kind of be looking out for him around 10 o'clock on Monday and Tuesday and uh, Monday and Wednesday and Thursday. And then my mama does her videos uh, Tuesday and Friday. So Stephen don't make videos on them days. Yeah, we've done the pecan shelling thing too, you know. Is Lori new, Monique? Lori says, love your video, so she ain't new. Thank you, Lori. Hey, what? Hey, hey, sell peas and butter beans. What? The price is right. That's right. Yep, sit outside in the shade and uh, sell peas and butter beans. Okay, Peg. You can watch the replay. And uh, here's something a lot of people don't understand about. I don't see too many people saying it on Stephen, but I see them on Mama's. The Stephen don't have nothing to do with the closed caption. Uh, it comes later on. Uh, YouTube does that. Yeah. Now you used that used to be something that you had to pay for. 
if you want to close captions. But YouTube does it now, and and uh, but anyway, it don't. You won't never see closed caption on a live, and then it takes a little while for the closed caption to show up. Uh, even after the videos, y'all know what I'm talking about. That's right. You know, like Joe says, you know what you know the thing. Uh, Stephen, do you need new paint? Ah, uh, the color. Let's see. Red, red is what I'm. It's it's crimp some chalk. Wearily. This is what I'm about out of. My green's full. My white's good. My teal's good. Peacock teal's good. Blue's full. Purple's full. My yellow's getting low too. My plaid yellow, my Weaverly. When I go, I try to buy the biggest thing I can find just to keep having to go back to the dang store every week. So let me tell y'all something. It ain't set in stone you got to order from that wish list. You can just buy one thing of paint. Uh, one container of paint. Oh uh, yeah, you know what I mean? <laughs> you don't really know, know how to do everything, you know. But you can just go in there and just get one one thing or... Christine Kennedy. $20, Steve. Oh, thank you so they much. They help pay for supplies. Thank you so much. That's very... Thank you, Miss Christine. Yep, thank you. This is something I ain't fit to stop doing. That's going to be plenty of it. Everybody will get a chance to get one. Y'all tell her how y'all tell Diane how to super chat. And I will tell you this right here, YouTube don't want you to know it. It's really better, like if you send it on PayPal, uh, than super chat and then we ain't, we ain't shooting nothing down. But you get more of the actual money on uh, Super Chat or, or if you just write a check, you know. I, I see Grandma get some checks down there, you know. Tell Miss Connie, I'm, this is hers. I'm making her by request. Who's that? Connie's Crafty Corner. Okay. Red, white, and blue. By request. So, Diane, you're going to be spending you some money, ain't you? Get the new heat and air unit. Oh, that ain't never fun. Ellen Klein. Fuel is her favorite cook. Purple. Yeah. Yeah, uh, you do get more of the money on PayPal than you do uh, on Super Chat. But that's, that's my preference, y'all, and, and you don't even have to see nothing if you don't want to. Uh, this ain't something you have to do, uh, but, but, but it's nice if you do. Yeah, going out of 
gonna have to rob a bank. She says, pay for that. Yeah. That air conditioner yeah. stuff's high now. Yeah, uh, yeah, you two get some of the Super Chat money. I heard Stephen saying last night that, that he could use acrylic. Acrylic paint, is that right, Stephen? Yes, sir. That chalk paint just covers real good. But, I mean, this right here is acrylic. Uh, folk art, acrylic. Y'all, I got to go in and get my, my computer charger. You ever hate to get up out of your chair? Yeah, I imagine. <laughs> hey, that's, that's too much money. $8,000 for a central heat and air unit. That's too much money. Nope. Twenty-five hundred dollars is what it is. Like if they come out and replace the unit, twenty-five hundred dollars is a fair price. Somebody's planning on not having to work the rest of the month. Oh. Uh, okay. Let me get back looking here. Connie's craft, crafty corner said she wants a church instead of a, the little bird out well, there. Well, Connie, now what am I going to do with this one? Ask does anybody want this one. It's available. Yeah, y'all y'all watch that. Uh, you know when I don't think I don't think everybody realizes but uh, I do think that was an accident about farm wife deleting that comment. I do believe that. I do believe it. But when when y'all do that, you know, everybody can see who done it, you know. So y'all be careful, you know. Yeah, if it says who done it. Yeah. Well, I mean, she said it was an accident, and I believe her. I do believe her. All right, I got to go get my, uh, I got to go in there and get my charger. All right. Will you want me to bring you something back? I'm okay. Y'all, it's a beautiful day out here today. Beautiful day. I'm glad I got my daddy here. I'm glad he's... There's something going on that keeps him interested. You know, ain't nothing worse than when somebody don't have nothing to do and they don't feel like they don't have any purpose and they just to themselves and don't do anything and I'm glad I could give my daddy purpose. I'm glad I have him in my Turn the camera around and show y'all he's like running out here. <laughs> <laughs> he spilled his tea a little bit coming out the step. Hey, I always do that. 
He got out here just in sight where I could see him and just started walking. Hey, former wife, don't worry about it. We, I mean, we all believe it was an accident. Don't worry about it. Y'all win. Hey, when I get on there and I'm replying to people, there's a bunch of times I've hit the dislike button because it's right beside re reply. Charlotte Smith said she would take it, and I assume it's that bird house you're working on. Just ship it cheaper on that birdhouse there. I got something I tell y'all that I just found out. You know they raising the interest rates, you know. And uh, I couldn't understand how raising the interest rates helps the economy. Because I know it, it slows the borrowing down, and it, and some people like have balloon notes, and like their their payments go up and everything. But I, you know, you always hear them talking about it, but you don't never know what they. They ain't never said what it actually does. But what it does is, is it slows the economy down, so prices will come down. And I mean, I just don't know if I agree with that. You know, they like slowing down the borrowing money, you know. So prices will come down. What was her name, huh? Lady that wants it. Oh, uh, let's see, uh, Charlotte, Charlotte Smith. Tell Miss Charlotte Smith to send me her address, and I'll definitely make sure she gets it. Okay, you heard Stephen there, Charlotte? Yeah, y'all ain't never gonna talk about politics because everybody's sick of that stuff. But I'm just talking about the, like the interest rates, you know? Like, I couldn't understand how that's supposed to help. It's... I mean, that's that's the craziest thing I've, I've ever heard. I believe I could think of something better to do than try, than try to slow the economy down more than what it is. Hey, Tony Z. Yeah. I see you there, Kathy. But I mean, for the longest, you know, I just didn't understand it. All right, y'all. Here's a red, white, and blue. bird house. I'll have this right here ready for you. Hey, I am too, I am too daily bread and if, you know everybody's so sick of that mess. You know I ain't gonna talk about it but everybody's so sick of all that mess. Boy, I believe like, it, I mean, they could tell me the facts and I mean, I believe I could come up with something better than purposely slowing the economy down.
Yeah, uh, yeah, Tony. Uh, you know, I mean, there's a lot of people that don't want to hear that stuff, and I mean, I, you know, I mean, I don't even, I don't even want to hear it myself. I mean, I know so much about it and everything. But they don't, not too many people want to watch no politic channel. Uh, you know, I'm just picking that one little subject here that's, it just seems like it's crazy to me. Hey, Monique, you know what? I don't think there's very much difference between a lawyer and a politician. Listen to that. Where's them dog? That Jada's dog? Farm wife. Girl, I told you to forget about that. Well, you understand accidents happen? Sign with a heart. That's it. If you think a lawyer won't, won't tell you what you want to hear, you go see one, you think he won't tell you what you want to hear. When you go in there and talk to him, Okay, Charlotte. Hey, Brenda. From Rock Mart, Georgia. Hello, Brenda. Okay, Sandra, if you, if you want one, just let us know. They don't, I've been up there with Stephen and Mama before. Boy, they don't like me up there, boy. You know, I can tell the difference between a lie and the truth, you know, real easy. I'm good at it. See my next message there, Stephen? I did not. I missed it. What to say, Hart? Stephen, do I get a sign cross with a heart, too? Yes, you do. I'll pick you right up. I watch the news a pretty good bit, y'all. And I'm I'm kinda uh I kinda got ESP or something like that anyway. And boy like I can just I can just see. I can see. Ask Monique do it. Can I just go with any color or does she want a color? Monique! What color you want your cross? Yeah, Tizzy, you know every one of them ain't like that. But there's a bunch of them that are. Every, every one I've ever seen, which, every one I've ever seen. You don't, you don't go get no lawyer unless it is absolutely necessary. Bird, if 
Flew right up here on the... <coughs> that brush is nice. I don't know what that... A Craft Smart brush. That thing works good. Monique says surprise me. She said my favorite color, and then she says, or just surprise me. So she wants purple or yellow? Or a bit of both. I doubt, I doubt I'll run this channel. What is it? Just somebody said, but watch out, I might ruin the channel. What I'm saying is true. And everybody saying no, you know, like, uh, no, nah, they, they ain't no way, you know. You just keep talking, Danny. <laughs> no way, Danny, we'll ruin this channel. Better think again, girl, if you think Danny's going to run this channel. Danny, you're pretty wise in my opinion. No, well, I mean, but it ain't, you know, uh, you know, we know better than discussing politics, you know. And uh, all I was talking about was the interest, you know, I didn't understand that. How yeah. that's supposed to help, you know? Yeah, I'm, I can assure you, if it was me, you would never hear the word come out of my mouth. Danny, you're the best of the best. But you always think outside the box. Danny, you, yeah. And then you tear the box down. Yeah, I didn't seen a few people like want me to run for president. Danny, you are so right about lawyers. You aren't going to run this channel. Keep talking. What you're saying is the truth. And I mean, that's all I was going to say about it anyway, you know. Danny, that a boy. Steven, that's a pretty blue. Dawn Hope. Dawn Hope. Thank you. Hey, I when I went when I went in the house a minute ago, Bentley's in there playing his game. Yet yeah, uh for the people that don't know. I guess most of y'all know, but Stevens, they's already, they, Stevens making these birdhouses for people that's done ordered them. Shine your light, Danny. Yeah, y'all, I'm just talking. Oh, uh, man, I'm just talking. I 
I asked the woman one day what she wanted me to talk about. The truth is nothing but the truth. Danny, keep talking. We love your talks. Talk on. We love you. That's right. Stephen's got one sister. She's a school teacher. She just got her master's degree. No. Huh? She, I think she's been had that, ain't she? No. No, she just got it. And... Hey, y'all, you know, her husband's a school teacher, too, and they saved her money. I think she's got her specialist. Well, she's been at that, but she's got her master's. Now, specialist is after master's. Well, she had, uh, she had a dual degree yeah. in college. And then she got her master's the other day. And, uh, okay, y'all. Yeah, her and her husband is teachers, and they ramble around, going everywhere. Uh, they got somebody in uh, her husband's family that's got a condo. And All right, y'all. Look at this pretty blue. What do y'all think about that? And there's, as of right this minute, I don't have a buyer for this one this one here is available it's blue i'm fitting to put my signature on it right now stay denny we love you you add to the live videos yeah like you know i'm supposed to be like helping steven you know i tell y'all something y'all won't hardly believe Oh, uh, well, you might well believe it, but I'm going to tell you. <laughs> <laughs> the, you know, we can look at the videos, and, and they got something called the audit's retention, you know. And every one that I'm in, the audit's retention is higher. So we can look at the video and tell, you know, they got a line running across there, like y'all seen it on the news before, like when the... Uh, People saying something everybody likes, and the line will go up, and then, and then when it it goes down, if they don't like something, it's something like that on YouTube, and and even on Grandma's videos, when I'm in them videos, their audience retention's higher, because I wouldn't want to hurt them, you know. Yeah. All right. When. DJ 28 is in there and look at that pretty right there. Has anybody said they wanted it hard? I ain't seen nobody, son. Yeah, I'll I ask them in a second. So, Grandma done a live the other day by herself because we was gone. And then the very next one we done, I was there. And that video got three or four thousand more views than the one she done by herself. And you say, well, how did they know you in there? You know what I mean? YouTube is monitoring that video, like how good it is. So they actually showing it to more people because people like that video. You know what I mean? They, they got every kind of statistic in the world, you know? These days said you want the blue one. DJ, 28? Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> so anyway, y'all, I mean, y you know, the, the numbers on YouTube don't lie, you know. I mean, even uh, uh, even like well, Stephen and Tammy and Bentley and uh, Phoebe done one the other day, and the numbers was lower. You know, and then the very next video, I was in it, and I was higher. 
and I ain't trying to brag about it, but but like, you know, I know that I help them. You know, I mean, it ain't really a guess. You know, I know I'm help. I know I help them. Okay, DJ. Is Monique still in there? Man, Monique always in there. Monique, are you still watching? It thanks, Tony. Hey, I, I wouldn't uh I wouldn't hurt them for nothing in the world, you know, but but see, I mean I made a channel, you know, and I ain't <laughs> Okay, there's Monique, Steve. Alright, Monique, I'm fit to do yours. What do y'all think about these beautiful bird houses, y'all? What do you think? Ain't they pretty? Tell DJ to better message me. Yeah, uh, so I don't forget. Yeah, he said he was gonna send you the money tonight. Okay. So y'all, here's what happens. YouTube knows when you make a good video. They know it. I don't know exactly how they know it, but they do. And then they'll take that video and and put it out. And uh, that's why come Stephen gets more views. Then he has subscribers. Uh, I mean, they know uh, what that video is doing. And that, and when it, if, if it's a good video, they'll take that thing and they'll show it to more people. Now, you know, uh, my grandma, you know, when I kind of first started helping grandma, and I wasn't helping grandma for me. I was helping grandma because I could tell she needed help, you know. Uh, but, like, they was, they was seven or eight people, you know, like giving me a fit, you know. Here it is, Monique. I'm fitting to paint it up. Christina Watson said, I would love to buy a kit. Michelle Wortham. Buy one every color. Have a treat. Sadly, I don't have a treat. <laughs> How much is the postage on the birdhouses? The churches are $20 and the... These up. Ask me that I just dip my arm in. These simple birdhouses... They're up. They're 15, and you know, obviously, can't ship one to United Kingdom, but but most of the time, right here, uh, it averages out that that works. But I've only had two that was crazy shipping. <laughs> All right, Monique, I'm fitting to get started on you. So see, Grandma. And I was trying to tell her with everything I had, you know. Grandma was like, like looking at them seven or eight people. You don't need him, you know. And she's like looking at them seven or eight people. Them same seven or eight people. Like the horse and buggy whip too, you know, before the car. But I mean, you, you just got to change with the times. And uh, I, I told her, I said, Grandma, I said, I said you, 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 you're talking about eight or, eight or ten people out of 10,000 people. But still, y'all, she'll see that in the comments and it will... See, I mean, I can work that out in my head, but, like, she knows now. Barbara Blake wants to blue. Hey, y'all, I mean, <laughs> y'all can tell me, but y'all got to get on Stephen's Facebook or either you got to mail him a check in, in the description. Uh, you can mail him a check and 
and tell him what what you want, what color he, y'all, he does a bunch of this stuff uh, off of camera. I mean, he's, I know you think, <laughs> boy, he's, as a lot of them goes through his hands. So y'all kind of get up with him and, and, and he can, uh, uh, he'll do it, y'all. Hey, I didn't, I didn't know like lowering the interest rates was political. That's something they do, y'all. I think the dog problem down there, I think they chained them dogs up. Uh, I think that, that uh, I think the they ain't no dog problem no more. Steven's got his camera up down there. Yep, and all I'm getting pictures of is grandma. If them dogs walk up there to that fence, uh he'll know it, you know, right then. You didn't put that lid on good. Yeah. Steven is Superman. Hey, I ain't stopping Stephen from talking. Not a bit. When Stephen's working, he don't talk. He don't talk much, y'all. I'm, but that's one woman. Yeah, you know, you always have to weigh things out, y'all, and I know you know that, but you you never, you never in your life going to make everybody happy. Nope. That's the reason churches break up and go separate ways sometimes. <laughs> Sandra, there's Sandra Presnall. She said, Stephen can't paint and read comments too. All right. This is you, Monique. How about that? All them beautiful colors in it. Oh, yeah, 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 y'all. I ain't bragging. I'm just telling y'all, so, I'm just telling y'all so you know. You know, I'm, I mean, I'm telling you why I'm sitting here, you know? You got so many beautiful... Surrounded by so many beautiful bird houses. Got green ones, got blue ones, red ones, purple ones, teal. No. 
Stephen, let me know a few minutes before you, uh, you know, gonna get off so I can go in there and get you, uh, get your video process. Okay. I can tell you this right here, Stephen. There is a whole bunch of people here that like to hear the truth. That's right. Without it uh, sugar-coated. Hey, ain't that the truth? And there's a bunch of people that don't agree with this, uh, this Tara here. As a matter of fact, almost everybody. <laughs> yeah. And I'm kind of just cutting up. I ain't picking on Tara. I ain't picking on her. But I mean, you know, I mean, everybody's a, a little different, you know. Hey, Tara, if you want to talk to Stephen, you can go to Facebook Messenger and you can message him. And he'll send you a message back. I try to answer everybody, and it takes, it's a job doing it now. <coughs> Preach on Brother Danny. just dawned on me I didn't have one that's pretty colored right here. Hey Angel, I got one that I've got one that's getting a patent on it and uh and then I mean uh <laughs> hey y'all I I make the best antenna you ever seen. And and there's reasons for it, you know, I mean there's uh it ain't it ain't just there's some little stuff that, that y'all don't know about, you know, that like making it like where it'll last forever, you know. It's I, everything soldered together. So what I'm saying about that is is an antenna, you uh, most antennas you buy, it's got rivets and all this. I got this antenna soldered together, and it's all one piece. Yeah, oh, uh, hey, you got that right, Tizzy. It's going to be beautiful right here. This one right here is available. If somebody want it, just jump in there and let me know. Yeah, I know you have, Tony. I know you've watched some of my videos. Hey, that, that Steven, he'll get on there and dance now. <laughs> I love it. Hey, Steven ain't shy a bit, y'all. I love to have fun. Yeah, y'all. I mean, they, especially that, let's see, let me make sure before I say something. Okay. What, what city you in, Angela? I see that Florida, but, oh. Like, see, I can turn my antenna around toward Jacksonville, Florida. And, uh, man, that Jacksonville's got a bunch, a bunch of channels. Like, any of them, any of them big cities, you know? Like, Atlanta has got a lot of channels. And, uh, I mean, Macon's got, Macon's what we watch here. It's got about 30 channels, but that... 
that Atlanta, it must have fixed 50 or 60 channels. This one's going to be mint. Anybody out there love a mint birdhouse? Hey, y'all, Steven's dog come in the house, that coca. And boy, them little dogs we got, they, they do not like coca being in that house now. The growling and stuff, that that coca just walking around like Steven, like can't do nothing. <laughs> them little munchkins, they won't even let her do nothing but just stand in one spot. Yeah. Got her in the headlock. Hey, Dallas, stay on eBay or the ultimate, the ultimate outdoor TV antenna. I, I mean, I'm, I'm fitting to quit selling them any day. I'm tired of it. Thank you, Mel. Hear the red bird? Uh, Stephen, uh, Texas gal uh, sent you a, a super chat here. Oh, thank you, Texas gal. No, you know, uh, I guess it wouldn't hurt for Stephen to get a website. Oh, uh, I mean, I can make a, I can make a website, or, uh, and and probably his son. Can probably do it with his eyes closed, you know. Ask, does anybody else want to cross? Does anybody else want to cross? Okay. Oh. Uh, now, I, I might have missed something, Steve. Texas gal won't see it. Wants this birdhouse? I don't know. I don't know. Oh. <laughs> I hear you there. You know, I'm still going to sell them around here, y'all. But that eBay. There's so many hands in your pocket. I make money, but it's still aggravating, you know. Okay. Oh, uh, she she wants someone Steve is working on, Michelle. Okay. There's there's the original gal right there. She said yes, I want it. She done sent the money, Steve. Texas gal. Good deal. Okay. So. So Michelle's backing her up, Michelle World. Yes, Danny, she wants that bird house. She paid for it. Texas gal wants the birdhouse. Kathy and David Bread want to cross. Hey, y'all, I don't know if Stephen can remember all this. Hey, them, them antennas is on eBay, y'all. It's uh, the, the ultimate outdoor TV antenna. I think it might be the ultimate outdoor HD TV antenna. Let me go get something, I'll show it to y'all.
I'm having to bend down to keep the fan from blowing out my torch. <laughs> I know you don't think it, you wouldn't think it blow a torch out, but it is. like I'm looking for the paint. Y'all ain't got my bit. But I'll just try to show y'all best I can. This is, this antenna is copper, y'all. This is copper. And under these screws, all these elements is soldered all together. And then see, I got my ballot soldered on here too. And uh, we always put a rubber coating on this. And this white stuff is part of the secret. Uh, I mean, I, I would have to explain it, but you just trust me, though. The white stuff don't cause no interference, like an aluminum antenna. And, uh, and they come with a reflector on it, too. But on a TV antenna, and, and I'm talking about any antenna, if one of these loses contact with the rest of the antenna, you know, like a folding antenna, where you fold them out and they knew about all like that. If they get a little bit of that stuff in there and they lose contact, that it'll hurt that antenna. And this is not being all soldered together. It won't. It won't. Uh, it won't never lose contact. And this copper, and this stuff right here is uh lifetime stuff right here. The sun don't hurt this. And, uh. Oh, more, yeah. One more thing, Stu. There you go, Texas girl. And then, uh. I didn't have none ready, y'all. But anyway, this is the reflector. My glasses fall down there. This is the reflector, and this is what it actually looks like. The reflector, if you think about a flashlight shining into a mirror, the signal comes in here, so it hits the antenna, and then it bounces off the reflector and, like, double hits it, if you know what I mean. I can promise you about 95% of the people did not know what you meant. About the flashlight. <laughs> There's your glasses.
He'll see the signal comes in, hits the antenna, and then it hits that reflector and bounces back on the antenna, like making it pick up double. Hey, Tony Z said he got you, that he understands that. Well, I thought so. Hey, what do y'all think about this right here? What do you think about the mint and the burnt? I like it. How about that? Beautiful. Uh, Daily Bread said three crosses. Hey, Daily Bread, I got... I only have one more available. I mean, I, I have to get some more done, but I can do I can do one for you today. You hear them birds all happy? Yeah, I do. Hey, y'all, really, uh, what I was planning on doing is selling what I got left and then quit. Uh, you know, I know that, I know that sounds kind of crazy, y'all. But, like, when we go off, you know, somebody has to be here to ship the stuff, you know. And, uh, when we go camping and stuff, I mean, it's, it's always, oh, uh, it's a little aggravating. And, uh, I got it where you can buy it several different ways. You know, some of them's got a booster and some of them's got a different kind of booster. And the people that I make the YouTube videos, they understand all that, you know. They actually know what kind of booster they need. Uh, but let me look right here. I think I've sold a thousand and two. I ain't gonna look, y'all. I, I got my mind on this right here. But I think I've sold a thousand and two of the, what you just seen. Uh, and got a hundred percent uh feed positive feedback. Got a cross, I burn it, and I polyurethane it. How about that right there? And this right here is Miss Monique's. <laughs> Funny, she, she ain't getting out of her chair some days. Look how pretty, y'all. <laughs> Alright, I gotta figure out how to get all this set up here. <laughs> Woo! Stephen had it figured up at one time how much he's he's paid in shipping, y'all. That snuck up on me. See, when, when you mess with eBay, y'all, you, you have to, you know, you you always having to, uh, what you call ship. And, and you got to be home to do it. Steve, how many bird houses have you shipped? Uh, I paid about 30... I paid out about $3,600 in shipping. Hey, look here, y'all. I'm fitting to go on in the house. I'm fitting to go on in the house and uh, start doing up Stephen's video. I like to do his, him and Grandma's video like before they finish. Well, you better take off running. Grandma won't never let me leave. <laughs> But, uh, I'm fitting head in the house. All right. So, bye, y'all.
how are y'all doing today? Y'all ready to see the finished product? We'll see y'all next time. I'll be down at Grandma's tomorrow. All right, all right well, thank you. Yes, sir. Thank you for helping. This right here is the beautiful project, y'all. Done today. You know, I still have three of them right here I could have done, but... Beautiful, beautiful custom-built birdhouses. I love doing this, y'all. I love, I love the crosses. I love the uniqueness. Green ones. Look how pretty that cross is. Monique, I can't wait for you to get that. Pretty red one. Pretty purple. It's just beautiful. All the colors just pop. Hey, thank you, Crystal. Miss Whistler. You are so welcome. Miss Whistler, yours is burnt with a red roof. So this is yours right here. I'm going to get that boxed up. I'm going to get this boxed up and get that to you. Thank you so much. Beautiful purple. Hey, ain't that pretty? I mean, goodness, that's pretty. Beautiful work. Mine is the blue one. That's right, DJ. This is yours right here. Hey, thank you so much for the love and support and, you know, wanting a project. There's the autograph and the heart on it. Thank y'all so much for just wanting to purchase something that, that I made. And that means a whole lot to me. Y'all are beautiful people. So much love and so much. Uh, respect you know here that we share together thank you miss carol tony z thank you thank you you welcome dj uh, dj 28 thank you uh, that's right here's florida girls uh, I, I about lost track of everything of who got what so i got to go back and make sure i got everything in order Debs loving stitches. Oh, thank you so much. Carla P, thank you. Thank you so much for being so kind. Vanessa. Sandra said hers. I missed I missed a comment. Stephen Gladys his own sees about her address. All right, CDJJ. Uh feel like I feel like I'm missing something I ain't real sure y'all which which birdhouse here did I make for CDJJ he uh, she's back in here and she don't know it I can't remember which one it was somebody help me out Hey, I hadn't been able to check it. I hadn't been able to check it. The green one, I think. All right, that's right. CDJJ, hey, thank you so much for your donation for Miss Gladys. Hey, I, I don't think he was on here at this time, but... Uh, hey. I, I got this one right here for you. I'm going to get that sent to you. CDJJ, so make sure, make sure you send me your address. I'm gonna send you this for doing a donation for Miss Gladys. I think you're sweet, and I may be saying it wrong, but I do have it wrote down, and I will go back and get it all straight. I got everybody panicking. and they's like, "Don't give mine away. That's mine." Hey, hey, I won't do it. I I'll, I'll keep it in order. I may have to go back on. Uh, I'm definitely gonna go back and watch the video, but. <laughs> oh that's so funny that's so funny but ain't they ain't they beautiful here's a little red white and blue one you know the simple birdhouse just just the little things you can do you know to brighten a day and, and that's what it's all about that's what it's all about on here 
making beautiful projects. Yeah, I enjoy the painting process, and I and I enjoy I enjoy the burning process. And, and hey, Miss Lynn, I, I enjoy being able to do positive things, and you know that's what it's all about. So. Let me get my chair right here. Let's see if I can get a good angle. So what a good day we've had. Had a beautiful day to do projects. Miss Connie Crafty Corner said the cross is stunning. Well, thank you so much. AKA Julie, I see you in there. Miss Willie Joyce, Michelle, uh, thank you so much. Y'all, this is, I have an awesome time doing this and y'all make it fun. Y'all make it fun. Shannon Craig, all right. Ain't, ain't we've had a good time. Do y'all have anything you wanna say? Uh, I can, I'm done right now. I can look at the comments. Miss Linda said I've done a wonderful job. Thank you so much. <laughs> Michelle said I make it fun. My, Elaine said how can I order? I sent PayPal for church. Okay, Amy Laura. I, that's right. I got you. I will order a birdhouse soon. Hey, if you go on my you put if you go on my YouTube page, the project is beautiful just like Steven. Oh, ain't you sweet? That was sweet. Thank you. Uh, you can go on my YouTube page, there's a link to my PayPal where you can just put a little description to know what kind of birdhouse you would like. I have I have these available that I build and, and I can custom paint them and burn them however you would like or Hey, I could send you one like this raw, and you can paint it yourself. Cause I know most of y'all, most of y'all on here are crafters. Cause you know this is a craft channel where we build and craft and do cement projects. And uh, let me show you, I got one right here that I made. Let me show you. If you're new to the channel, this is a cement sunflower that I done and painted. So if you like crafting and, and you like painting and you like positivity and fun and laughing and hey, we'll cry together, we'll laugh together, hey, we'll do it all. We'll do it all. <sighs> Look at this, y'all. I did a turtle. <laughs> How cool is that concrete turtle? I painted it. Daddy said, man. Let me back it up a touch. Daddy said, man, if that ain't, if that ain't the realest looking turtle I ever seen. Uh, but all, all kind of things go on here. We forever doing some kind of project. Hey, thank you, Crystal. Love that turtle. Turtle was awesome. Hey, that's, that's video. You can go back and look where I done the turtle. Uh, if I ain't mistaken, I think I done, I think I did the turtle and the sunflower on the boat. I'm not real sure. I believe I was at the river. So, you know, lots of things. Lots of things. Uh, Debs love stitches. Yes, I did have a form for it. Hey, some people call that cheating, but uh, hey, I ain't no master at it. I, I I just enjoy doing it, and and I enjoy the painting process, and and I enjoy when Koki hits the tripod. All that makes my day better, and you know, hey, yes, you was on the river. That's right. I thought I was. Hey, ain't no telling what we gonna do. 
or where we gonna be, or who's gonna be here, or what we gonna be making. So, one thing about it, when I have y'all to be a part of it, Miss Gladys, I'm in tears. Nobody never did anything for me like this. Amen. Miss Gladys, let me, let me show you which one's yours. Let me get my... All right. Burn with a red roof. That's Miss Whistler. Burnt Church White. That's Miss June's. Aqua White Roof. That's Miss Lori's. Gladys, yours is the purple one. Let me show you why you're on here, sweetheart. Oh, this, see, this is what it's all about. This is what I do it for. There you go, Miss Gladys. You got a beautiful purple church. How cute is that? That's for you, sweetheart. That's, uh, it's, it's little sweet ladies just like you. And, and CDJJ, thank you for donating. Uh, that for her hey y'all that that's what it's all about we have a beautiful time together we help one another out we pray for one another we, like, like we do this as one and i've never been a part of such a beautiful process is what we have going on uh, i want to say thank y'all so much y'all fill my heart with so much love that it's just it's just uh, about the bus slam out. It's I'm, I'm so at peace and you know. Thank y'all for being y'all. Thank y'all for being sweet. Wait, she wanted the blue one. Hey, I might be wrong. I have it all sorted out on video, <laughs> but I have to go back and get it all straightened out. But. Hey, that's the problem when you start painting a bunch and you start doing stuff off script. DJ said, mine's the blue one. Don't make me slap nobody. <laughs> I'm just kidding. DJ didn't say that. That's what that's what a mystery man would say. Oh, gosh. That's right, DJ. I remember. The blue one's yours. Ain't that funny, y'all? Don't we have a good time? Uh, y'all don't forget little man's birthday. We we planning it this week. We're gonna be singing. We'll be Facebook live. Uh, he wants he wanted a cake and uh, he wanted to do. Well, actually, he didn't say he wanted a cake. I'm saying he wants a cake. But we getting him a cake and we're gonna have singing. He wanted his sisters over here and uh we're gonna put on a beautiful concert for y'all y'all be looking for that this week i'll give y'all a heads up when it'll be the, the main thing is my daughter works uh she works about an hour from here she so by the time she gets off work i gotta make sure we can work it all out so we will have that on there for you that's something crawling on me Y'all, the birds is using the bird feeders. It's, I love it. Listen, I hear birds right now. I've heard birds all day long. All day long I've heard birds. And they're coming in slowly but surely. And <laughs> Brittany Bobby, make two blue ones. Hey, I certainly can. I would, I would love to. It would just make my day to, to craft something and send it out to you. And, uh, you know, it's going to be good. It's always good. We sure make the best of it. Elizabeth, hello, Miss Kathy. <laughs> Love all the birdhouses. 
Well, thank you so much. Miss Gladys says, you're a gift from heaven. That's sweet. I ain't never had nobody tell me that. Thank you. You are the first. Cindy P., you can get one. Just send me a message. Let me know which one you would like. Tony said he don't do Facebook. Hey, hey, I understand. No, it's not for everybody. I, I do have some sweet ladies on here that also said that. And uh, she said, I'm adding Facebook just to see you sing, and then I'm logging out. And I said, hey, that's fine with me. So, Tony, that might be something you can do. Add, uh, add it. Watch the singing. Sign out. Hey, and that's a done deal. Uh, I understand people like the privacy and they don't want to be harassed and all that. Hey, that's understandable. Understandable. But they just a little content, little extra stuff y'all could get. And, uh, you know, y'all the reason why I do what I do. And y'all make it all possible. I got my sweat going on. I feel it. Well... Going to be here watching next video. All right, y'all. Y'all have a good day. Thank y'all so much for being sweet. Y'all remember to share this video to your Facebook. Everybody that shares it, it shows me who shares it. And I got about five people that do it every single time without, like, like clockwork. They, they need a special. They need a special kind of surprise. But thank y'all for sharing. Thank y'all for being sweet. Y'all have a good day, and I'll see y'all in the next video. <laughs> All right, bye-bye.